verses from John chapter 15, starting with verse 1. And I'm not going to make very much progress this morning, but I think there's something very, very encouraging for us to hear from the very lips of Jesus. I am the true vine, and my Father is the vine dresser. Every branch in me that does not bear fruit, he takes away. And every branch that does bear fruit, he prunes, that it may bear more fruit. Already you are clean because of the word that I have spoken to you. Okay, so first off, we have to hear this correctly. Jesus is not speaking to me and you personally. He is speaking to his apostles, to his disciples that he has chosen to send out into the world. And indeed, he's speaking, one of those apostles is John, who actually wrote this down. And so let, let's be fair and humble ourselves before the text. Jesus isn't talking to me and you. He not directly. He is talking to his disciples and he is saying that they are already clean. Already clean now and um, because of the words that I have spoken to you. So the pruning of the Father, the Heavenly Father's work in their lives has already taken place and is already taking place because the Father, by the Lord Jesus Christ, the incarnate word, is speaking to them. And that word from Jesus brings forth faith. And that faith clings to Jesus. And that is their righteousness. That is their, that, that is their cleanliness. That is their purity. Now, since Jesus said this to his apostles, and since this is true of them, it's also true of us. The Father purifies us. The Father prunes us. The Father takes away all the dead stuff by the words of Jesus. And that word of Jesus is what we're reading. That's the Bible. Uh, that is the word by which the Heavenly Father is purifying our lives. That is, he's focusing our faith on the Lord Jesus Christ. Because through the words of Christ, we focus on Christ we put our faith and our trust in Christ, and that purifies us of listening to the false words of the world, our own flesh, and the devil. And it is the Father's joy to purify our lives. Yes, Jesus is the true vine, and we are branches. And the Father is pruning our lives as we listen to his son speak to us from the scripture. God bless you and God keep you today.